I think choosing the Bahrain Center for Human Rights uh, for this award uh, does several services to the human rights movement in Bahrain. First of all, Bahrain is one of the countries where um, we, we don't receive as much media support or international media attention as necessary to highlight the ongoing human rights violations. And a prize like this helps shed light on the situation on the ground and how the situation actually continues to deteriorate. When you have almost 2,000 people who are political prisoners in a country of a population of 600, 700,000, that's a pretty big number, that's a pretty big percentage. Um, but of course, because Bahrain is a small country and it's not in the benefit of, especially the Arab media, to pay attention to what's going on in Bahrain. I like to call it the inconvenient revolution.